the uh, board uh, of PhilHealth uh, has already uh, directed management, uh, PhilHealth, no, to already create a uh, ad adverse event following immunization to include severe uh, side effects uh, on account of uh, the use or inoculation with any vaccines. This will be uh, covered by PhilHealth uh, through that benefit package. But again, uh, that was not uh, included in the corporate operating budget uh, for 2021. Uh, and so I would like to uh, suggest that if any fund may be identified or a source uh, be identified to uh, fund this particular indemnification, siguro dapat ang mag-administer ng fund na yun, yun ang PhilHealth, para sila na yung gagawa ng uh, benefit package. So instead of giving it straight to people, as a compensation for whatever uh, side effects they might experience, it will be filled out through uh, reimbursements uh, to hospitals that will provide uh, the cure or the treatment of the adverse uh, effects. Uh, hospital, uh, Secretary. Uh, they're waiting for your payables. <laughs> that's the, that's uh, the uh, truth. Ang sabi ng isang hospital owner, if you don't have one billion in cash, you'll close up because it takes so long for PhilHealth to pay up. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll talk to uh, to uh, President CEO Geran to uh, <laughs> ask that. Oh, yes. Uh, I That's mean, the reality on the ground. Uh, Umiiyak itong mga small hospital owners, uh, Secretary. Yeah, in, yeah. In we will get... case of uh, reimbursements of PhilHealth. And then we're going to give them more on their plate. 